Here I'm at the mouth, mouth of the swamp, going back in there. The second check on these traps, I'm pulling everything today. Get ready to go see family for Christmas. But uh, hopefully we got a few catches. I pulled the ones out that were at the stick lodge up in the shallow grass location. Because it was just going to be too difficult to get to. Mostly what I got is a few neutral traps out and one beaver set out at a caster mound. We'll see if we made any catches this morning. I'll get it started. Nothing on set number one, but you can just see their trail going up through there. But, uh, ready to go. Gonna pull it and get out of here and keep moving on down the set line. But, uh, Hopefully we got a catch somewhere. I don't expect a whole lot. Weather was nasty. We'll see. Right, I'm getting down to set number two. I do have a catch on the cable. On the uh, uh, the trap. It's, the cable's running down in the water. But uh, it's not drowned. I don't know what it is yet. I saw the waves a minute ago. It's still playing hide and seek. <clears throat> if usually if it's a neutral, he would have done been down the cable and drowned it. Might be a beaver, I can't tell yet. But uh, he'll pop up here in a minute. And we'll get him dispatched and show him to you. But it uh, didn't look huge. But it's, uh, it did not drown. We'll see in a minute. Do we have catch number one in the boat for the morning? Big nutrient. But uh, I'll get him stored up in front of the boat and keep moving down the sets. But this is catch number one. I'll get, to get them pulled as I get along. It's basically all I'm doing is I'm finding these trails where they're coming through these pads. This is set number three I'm pulling this morning. It didn't hit. But the, uh, <laughs> everything comes through these trails. We'll get this and pulled and keep moving. I'm gonna set number four. No takers on it, but I'll get it pulled and stored and keep moving. Surely we've got something somewhere else. I don't have a lot of sets out, but with this, the weather changing, stuff should have been moving. We'll find out in the next few sets. Well, no takers on this set. I was hoping. <laughs> with the amount of poop they've got all over this pad i figured this is where they'd be but uh nothing last night i'll get it pulled and keep going but uh, should be some more catch hopefully at least one more catch anyway i probably only got about 10 sets out but uh, i'll get them pulled before this massive cold front comes in and and we've got to go to Christmas. We'll keep moving. That's just funny. I got down to the next Nutraset I had. But a beaver has decided he wanted to push my cable and bury my cable in his caster mound. I will be back in here for these. He pushed my cable and buried it in this caster mound. I'll get that one pulled and keep going. But uh, they did that last night. <laughs> keep moving. I'm getting down to the next set. That's a neutral pad that right here where they all sit. And things are kind of chewed up in the grass. And... Uh, I don't know, let's try it this way. Let's see if we get it alive. Stay up. Uh. Wanted to poke around and get it loose. Something down there. We'll see. Big neutral. Big old neutral. 
big full grown adult, but he'd gotten tangled up down in the root. What I have created is just a long handle paint roller extension. When I put a hook on the end of it, which allows me to get down in there and get stuff loose when they get tangled up in root. It was just a toe catch. And he pulled it out in about probably, I don't know, it's about a seven, eight foot long rod right now extended just to get down to where he was tangled up. Whew. Catch number two in the boat. And it's another big one. I'll go up and get the uh, fiberglass rod pulled and collapse this retrieval stick and keep moving i well, got nothing on this pad set but as i pulled up here to get this there was two took off running out of this grass mat and went that way <laughs> uh, just didn't just didn't catch they were here i mean it was 15 feet away out in that grass mat i'll get it pulled keep moving these beaver are gonna be in trouble after christmas <laughs> They're leaving these mounds like this all over the place. Freshly topped off. Found uh, three stick lodges in here. <clears throat> and they're all got fresh mud. I'll get down to the next stick lodge. I'll, I'll pull in there and show you. But uh, these beaver going... <laughs> after Christmas, they're going to be rounded up. I promise you that. They're just they're too active in here. I'll keep moving on the Nutrisets. These beaver are in so much trouble. <laughs> There's fresh mud everywhere. Big lodge and very active. <laughs> I haven't poked around and found the den holes, but I can catch them where they're mudding. Like right here would be a place for a set. They're coming up here bringing all kind of mud and new sticks up on their lodge put a snare right there or something but uh <laughs> yeah they in trouble after christmas you find lodges like that you have to set it that thing's probably i'm flat even in the water and it's probably five feet above my head up to the i mean it's it's up there it's way above me and uh, yeah <laughs> they in trouble. <laughs> I got nothing on this Nutri pad set. That just leaves one caster mound remaining. And I put fresh beaver dope on it yesterday when I was in here. It's probably got a catch, hopefully. Something had to go on because it was just too active to not. But uh, I'll get this trap pulled and get down to that caster mound. Let's see how these these uh, dirty 3 8 rods just blend in with like the cattails and stuff in here and that's the 3 8 rod it looks just like the other brush in here I'll get down to the caster mount I'm just shocked this set is sit here two days and didn't get hit and there's fresh mud back up on top of the mound traps here the beaver came up over here, missed it by about 10 inches. <sighs> He'll be here when I come back, but uh, I should have set two sets here with this much sign and didn't, but uh, this one cost me. I'll get it pulled and get out of here. I mean, Not caught this year. I ain't gonna tell. I got three freezers full, but uh, I got a. Uh, just the two neutrals today. That one's really large. Uh, I'm gonna dry it out and see if that ain't something somebody wanted to mount. Somebody got a hold of me saying they was wanting a big one. That's definitely a big one. So that's, a, that's full grown right there. Yeah. This one's Most probably smaller than that. Then yeah, a lot of them. You get catch them anywhere between a a muskrat and a two-year-old beaver. What do they feed on? The most vegetation. just vegetation, lily pads, yeah. uh, duck duckweed. Like bad foot. Yeah, he'd been caught before somewhere. Yeah. 
but uh well, you might have got your trap and got out <laughs> probably, probably. <laughs> uh, i'll catch y'all later